Today, I have the pleasure of speaking with Dr. John Gluckman from Six Wave Innovations. How are you today, Dr. Gluckman? I'm fantastic. Thanks for having me again, Tracy. Dr. Gluckman, never has Six Wave been more critical to our market than 2022, 2021, and the COVID virus. Can you tell us how Six Wave is offering a solution to alleviate some of our stress? So, you know, uh, when this happened, we decided uh, that we could utilize our molecular imprinted polymer technology for detection of these kinds of airborne pathogens, whether they're bacteria or viruses. Uh, over the last year, we have successfully developed a polymer that can detect the COVID virus and all of the variants that we've been exposed to so far at levels that are better than immunoassay tests. And we do this with a completely artificial polymer technology, our MIPS. And we've been able to prove that with electronic detection, with fluorescent detection, and with, um, uh, with visual detection. And so we're now at the final end of doing uh, cross-reactivity testing or against a battery of uh, 50 different pathogens. And uh, starting next month, we'll be productizing our first, uh, our first products for diagnostic tests for COVID uh, and submitting that for clinical trials uh, in just the next 60 days, roughly. Okay, so your news release you just put out about partnering with Trace Safe. Yeah, yeah. Can you talk to us a little bit about that? Yeah, so, you know, um, depending on who you think, talk to, maybe we're late in the game for COVID. Uh, but the news today on COVID has been, uh, you know, showing that as we're decreasing masking, that that's going to continue to plague us and numbers are going up around the world. One of the interesting things, though, is that we set out from the very beginning to develop a platform for being able to rapidly develop products for any pathogen. And one of the areas that's come to the forefront besides human pathogens is protecting the food chain. And there are significant pathogens that happen in agriculture. There's African swine fever, there's uh, N1H1 or avian flu that we've all heard about. And these are highly communicable and there are really no uh, tests that are deployable in this market. So uh, we can very rapidly, instead of imprinting for COVID, use our platform and imprint for African swine fever and create the same kinds of rapidly deployable surveillance systems, things that can operate by uh, constantly sampling water supplies or uh, waste streams, or even being used by the vet as a test that they can take out to the farm, test an animal, and right there be able to determine that the animal was sick and what corrective action needs to be taken to quarantine animals. You know, the Canada, for example, exports about 80% of its pork. We're very lucky that we don't have African swine flu here quite yet, or fever here quite yet. But when we do, that's going to have a significant impact on exportability. China's had to destroy millions of hogs from this, and it's running rampant and being spread by feral pigs and hogs throughout Europe. So these are the kinds of pathogens that have the potential to really impact our food supplies and our economy here in Canada and around the world. And there are no tests. And we're working very feverishly now to configure not just a test from the sensor standpoint, which is our piece, but from a larger information sharing and surveillance platform, which is the piece that Trace Safe is bringing to the table. So question for you, Trace Safe. Patents, because this sounds very complicated. It does sound complicated. Can you tell us about the patents that you have or the competitive uh, advantage of the Trace Safe technology? So, Trace Safe is really a communications technology. It's based in Bluetooth and other kinds of things. So, <clears throat> if you think about contact tracing, if you will, you get data. So, you have a sensor like ours that says, hey, you have COVID or that uh, this farm has African swine fever. What TraceSafe is going to provide is the ability for us to take that electronic detection and transmit it to a contact tracing system where all that information will be observable, whether that information is observable to the farmer or whether it's observable and managed by the veterinarian 
or whether it's managed by, um, by uh, regulatory environments. And there are industry associations that even have their own self-reporting tools. And so what TraceSafe brings to the table is the ability for us to get from our sensor to automatically reporting the data to places that it's needed. For more information on TraceSafe or to speak to Dr. John Gluckman, please email the following email or go to this website. Thank you so much, Dr. Gluck, Dr. Gluckman, for the update today from Six Wave Innovations. Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you again, Tracy.